Welcome back, another week, another hopefully good day of content. I'm gonna try and not look at myself so much in the viewfinder today. It's actually harder than you think. Um, but anyways, uh, today I wanted to do like a Christmas Grinch inspired look. Something that you could definitely wear to Christmas dinner with the fam, even Thanksgiving dinner since that's the closer holiday for Americans. Um, and just something subtle. I'm not gonna be like this cr crazy Grinch look where I've got you like with a who knows. I'm not even that talented. So yeah, that's on the agenda today. I'm going to be using the cutest palette of all time, which is obviously this one from ColourPop, the Star Wars Mandalorian collection. Um, my aunt actually sent me this and it was so nice of her to do so. And it's truly the cutest. So let's get into it. Before we get into it, if you're new to my channel, hey, what's up? I'm Jenna. I am a gal who loves makeup. I don't consider myself a beauty guru. Everyone here just wants to have fun with makeup. I buy a lot of it. And so I tend to make a lot of videos about it because if I'm spending my hard earned coin, at least I can do is help people out with if they should spend theirs on it or not, in my opinion. So welcome, hang out a while. We have fun here, hopefully. So these are the shades. It is five shimmer shades and four, or five matte shades, sorry, and four shimmer shades. Um, it's the same formula as every other color pop palette. So if you have one, you got them all, you know the formula, it's nothing new. Um, so I'm gonna go in with Baby Face right there, which is like a green, like a muted green, but nothing crazy. Ooh, kickback. All right. And I am going to just take that into my crease. It is not like the most pungent green. Put my hair behind my ears. That I've ever seen, but that's kind of good. I don't really want, like this is gonna be something we're, we're gonna try and keep subtle, um, you know, so we don't wanna look crazy at our holiday dinner. Um, so I don't really want it to be a crazy bright green, but just if you're looking at this palette um, for the cutest packaging ever. Um, just be aware it's not gonna be like a super bright green palette. It's a it's very muted. That's the words I've been searching for. Muted. Are we having fun yet? Sorry, it's really not even showing up on this camera. Hey. Yeah, it is right. I'm just gonna go in with one more layer. I do need it a little bit brighter than that. Cause I man, these color shades are getting all over the pal the palette like itself like look I've only used how much I don't know if you can really tell but it's all over the outskirts just from me dipping in the middle of the pan if that doesn't tell you anything I don't know what will all right so I think I'm just about ready to move on from the crease blend it out this isn't gonna be like a super long tutorial which is probably nice for you because you don't need to see me do everything I'm sure you're probably so skilled yourself, darling. Um, I already, as you can tell, I already have my complexion on. If you're like, wait, you look weird. That's why. Um, so I'm going to take this Morphe brush. I don't know the number. It's old. It's old. I don't have a Morphe code. <laughs> I'm not a guru. All right. I'm just going to blend that out. My arm looks so weird. <laughs> but I'm trying to give you like the best angle I possibly can to let you see what I'm actually doing. Okay, I'm actually gonna look at myself in the viewfinder because I think that helps you see what I'm doing. All right, so I'm just kind of making that green um, blend it out in the edges so that it's not, doesn't look like a line of green on my face. We wanna be Grinch, but we don't wanna be whole green face Grinch. All righty. Okay, cool. So then I think that's kind of like, yeah, that's what about what I want. Um, so then I'm going to take this, this shade, sorry. It's called the force. May the force be with you. May the force be with this look. So I don't make an ass out of my fool out of myself. <laughs> Children, Jenna. Um, I'm just going to dip into that. And I'm actually going to put this all over my lids. Like this, I'm just gonna, I tend to pat and swipe. Um, learned that little trick 
especially with shimmer shades. Like matte shades easily pat on, but shimmer shades, and this is like a chunky glitter shimmer too, so it's like gonna get everywhere. Um, it's easier if you do pat it on and pack it that way. I'm sure you all know that. <laughs> Um, but you know, your girl's just here to remind you, just here to let you know. Yeah, that's pretty subtle. That's what I like. Not going to look like the Grinch at Christmas. We're going to look inspired by the Grinch. He's an inspiring guy. All right. Four thirty, chazzle size. Six thirty. <laughs> Dinner with me. Okay. I'm sorry. Not an impression person. Don't know what I'm thinking. Um, it's packing on nice, which is refreshing. I never know when I dip into shimmer shades how they're going to actually perform. They seem to be quite all over the place. Um, even within ColourPop itself, I've bought those like super shock shadows. It's too much effort for me. It's the effort for me. <laughs> um, because honestly, like it came with instructions. It was like, in order to make these super shock shadows work, do it with your finger and like wet your finger, <laughs> like all this stuff. And I was like, bro, it's supposed to just go on my eyes. You know, like it's 2020. We all need to less complicate, uncomplicate our lives. So I'm not about the super shocks, super shocks, super shocks. I did it. All right. I'm going to try and dust away some of that excess glitter which is like an impossible feat but we're gonna try cool so honestly that is pretty much all I have in mind for Grinch inspired um, I'm gonna actually add I'm gonna take this Morphe M506 and I'm gonna go back in with the baby face one more time just right into that crease I don't know why I always open my mouth. I heard it's something to do with concentration. I saw like a TikTok about it. As we do. That's my Moira Rose. I know it's bad, but don't act like you haven't tried it if you watch Shit's Creek. Definitely tried to do a Moira. All right. And then actually, just to like add a little zest here, a little dimension to it, I'm gonna take this little frog which is, it's a matte green with like a little bit of reflect, but I think that reflect will actually work nicely in the, in the outer V, if you wanna call it, if we're gonna get technical. Um, so I'm just gonna put that there because it'll blend nicely with the green and the gold. It'll be kind of like a nice transition and we'll still keep this all very subtle. I'm not gonna pack too much, just a nice little dimension for when you turn your head and everyone sees you from the side. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Welcome to my life. Okay, let me just put my hair behind my ears again. All right. And I'm just packing it in with this fluffy brush because I don't want it to be packed with a denser brush. Um, otherwise, I think that will overpower the, the gold there. So, perfect. Yas, queen. She's a Grinch. She's a mean one, Mr. Grinch. It's really hard to talk while you do your eyeballs. All right. Cool. Let's blend that out a bit. I'm starting to look like, do you guys remember the Drew Carey show? What was her name? His like, Girl that like I think he hated, but I think she had a crush on him, but she acted like she hated him too. What was her name? I used to watch that show all the time when I was like really, really little, like six. <laughs> That's how old I am. That's kind of what it looks like right now because I don't have any eyeshadow on or anything. <laughs> or any eyeliner on or mascara. So I am going to put my eyeliner on. I'm gonna use the Stilla Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. You can get this off of Amazon. Um, 
if you love Amazon like me, for actually a really good price. It was just on their Prime Day sale, so I snagged a couple. And then I'm also gonna use the telescopic, the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. I talked about it in my previous video or two videos ago um, about how I've been like converted back to drugstore um, mascaras and this is the one, this is the keeper, this is my holy grail right now. I'm absolutely loving it. So I'm gonna go put this on and I will be right back. Okay, I'm back, obviously. It was like two second transition. Um, I also wanted to mention that that mascara I just talked about, it's like six bucks. Um, don't quote me though, it might be like, it's definitely under $10. Um, and I don't have long or thick lashes and this is what it does to my eyelashes. Um, so I highly recommend it. It's completely an illusion. I do not have long lashes. So I just like how full they look and how like, I don't know, nice they look. They look, they almost look like fake lashes, dare I say it. So yeah, I would highly recommend that. I think you can get it at like Ulta and then like any drugstore, so telescopic. Anyways, this is my finished Grinch inspired look. Obviously super subtle, super easy to wear to the dinner table. Um, I ended up putting like a little bit of a lip blush on just cause I personally have some pigmentation issues on my lips. So a finished look never really looks polished unless I put something on. Um, I don't know if I'd wear something to turkey dinner cause it would get everywhere, but anyways, this is it, um, just a really subtle green gold eye look. Um, super easy for you to replicate and do yourself. And hope you guys loved it. Hope you guys had fun with me. I know I ramble a lot, but like that's part of the fun, right? That's what I'm gonna tell myself. Check me out on TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, like to know it. I'm all on literally all of those platforms, contributing different types of content to those platforms. You get to see my kiddo, my little baby on Instagram and TikTok, which is a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, hope you guys had fun and I will see you next week. If I'm organized enough. <laughs> okay. Bye. Uh, I hope I didn't look in the viewfinder the whole time. I'm working on it. Oh my gosh. Bye.